So as you can see, people, the nutrition facts say zero calories. What's up, my friends? Welcome to another video. I'm Rob Stewart. I'm here to help you get your skin and your overall health back on track. Have you ever wondered why Pam and other non-stick spray companies can say that there is absolutely no fat and absolutely no calories in their spray? when in the ingredients it actually has oils and fats listed. Is this true? What's going on? Is Pam lying to us? In today's video, I'm gonna give you the scoop on why they can do this and if there's actually fat and calories in these nonstick sprays. Stay tuned. <laughs> So here's the thing you guys, so many of you are working your asses off, working really hard to try to get your skin disease reversed and you want to pick something up like this Pam so that you can make some healthy vegetables, maybe put it on your potatoes so that they don't get all stuck to the bottom of your pan, your pan. Problem is, is that Pam lies to us. Did you know that there's actually fat and calories and oil in every single one of these bottles? So. If you're one of those people who's trying to avoid oil and avoid excess fat in the diet and you're using this stuff, you're self-sabotaging yourself. Let me explain the process of why they're able to get away with this. So the FDAA allows companies to say that there's zero calories and zero fat in something if there is 0.25 grams of that substance or less inside of the bottle. And what do you know? There's exactly 0.25 grams of whatever is in here in each serving. The problem is, is that the serving size is literally this. So here is what one serving size of this crap would look like. That's it. Ready for it again? That's it. That's small. And this is how most people do it. Not the same. The second one with all that long spray is probably 150 to 200 calories of straight oil BS. And no one uses the spray in that way. Normally when you see someone using this stuff, it's like over the entire pan, over the cooking sheet, whatever you're using. And that could be putting onto your food 100, 150, 200 calories of straight oil and straight fat that will sabotage your skin recovery process. So that's how they get away with the lie. The bottom line is do not use Pam, do not use other calorie-free nonstick sprays when you're cooking your food because you're actually eating a ton of oil and a ton of fat and your skin health will suffer because of it. So as you can see, people, the nutrition facts say zero calories, zero fat, zero cholesterol, zero carbohydrates, but then, if you look down here at the ingredients, it has cornola oil, coconut oil, all sorts of ingredients. To get away with this is that because there's 0.25 grams or less in each serving, they're allowed to say zero. The problem is the serving size is a size spray and no one does that. Again, Check in with yourself, make sure you're not using this stuff. Even if you think you're only doing a quick spray, you're probably not anyway. Even that much still has fat, still has oil. So ditch the Pam, ditch the other nonstick sprays that say that they're calorie free and go with water, go with steaming, go with something else. Later on this week, I am gonna put out a video on how to cook without oil. I do have an old one, check it out. But that's gonna be it for today, guys. I just wanted to drop some knowledge and let you guys know to stop using this stuff because it will mess you up long term. Thanks for watching, you guys. I hope that made sense. If you're new to this channel, remember to subscribe and share. Leave all of your questions and comments down below. Remember to hit me up on the Instagram. It's Stuart Rob Stewart. I have daily inspiration there. Check it out. Follow, like. And if you are looking to get a hold of me, to become one of my private clients, simply follow the link in the description and I will help you get your skin nice and healthy. Have a great day, you guys. I'll be back with many more videos really soon. Peace.